And a special thanks and shout out to Community Chrysler Dodge Jeep and Ram of Martinsville, Indiana for allowing me to come out and film this 2019 Ram 1500. Hello everyone, today we're going to take a detailed in-depth walk around look at this brand new 2019 Ram 1500 Limited Crew Cab. And this Ram 1500 is painted in billet silver clear coat metallic. It features the black premium perforated leather interior and features the stitched accent filigrees. And this truck is equipped with the active level four corner adaptive air suspension system. It does feature the entry exit levels as well as aero ride, normal ride height, off-road one and off-road two modes. It is a fully adaptive suspension system. And this truck is four wheel drive and it does feature the push button controlled shift on the fly transfer case. And power comes from the 5.7 liter Hemi 345 cubic inch overhead valve 16 valve variable valve timing engine V8 engine. It creates 345 horsepower and 410 pound feet of torque. The gross vehicle weight rating is 7,100 pounds and features a 3.21 axle ratio. It features a 8,240 pound trailer towing capacity with a 1,840 pound payload capacity. And the engine is mated to the 8-speed Torque Flight 8HP75 automatic gearbox. Features a rotary e-shift controller mounted to the instrument panel. On the steering wheel, you do also have your gear change buttons. And looking around the rear of the truck, all new LED tail lamps are installed on this model and also incorporate rear blind spot monitor radars. Turn indicators are now amber colored and also LED. On the tailgate, the prominent RAM badge in the center is displayed along with the trim name on the lower left hand side. This truck is equipped with the trailer tow group and features 4 and 7 pin wiring plugs as well as a receiver hitch. covers in the license plate frame for the 4 and 7 pin wiring as stated above. You've also got LED license plate lights. Truck is sitting low because the suspension is in the entry exit mode. And steering on the rams is electrically power assisted rack and pinion. Wheels are the 20-inch polished aluminum six-spoke wheels and feature Bridgestone Dueler HL 275-55 R20 tires. 
Brakes are upgraded for 2019 with ventilated discs measuring 14.9 inches up front and 14.8 inches in the rear. They are assisted with ABS and electronic brake force distribution. And taking a look around the front of the truck, the limited trim features its own unique grille treatments. And this vehicle does feature LED turn indicators, LED adaptive headlamps and LED driving lights, gloss black trim in the center of the grille, Here's an up-close look at the projector beam headlamps with the LED lighting. Down below, you also have LED fog lamps, chrome-plated tow hooks. And this vehicle is equipped with a remote start. To operate is simple, just press the remote start button twice on the key fob. And locking and unlocking the vehicle is easy with Chrysler's Keyless Enter and Go Smart Key Access System. By keeping the key fob in your purse or pocket, you're able to electronically lock and unlock the vehicle doors. To lock, simply locate the button on the door handle and press. The horn will chirp and the vehicle will lock. To unlock, simply grab the handle as you would open it. As you can also see, you have power deployable running boards. And inside the limited RAM is very, very nice. Very nice attention to detail with high quality of craftsmanship. Soft touch leather door upholstery with accent stitching. You've also got a wood trim with the white stripes in it and a polished burnished copper accents. And of course this vehicle does feature power heated power fold away mirrors with LED signal repeaters. They've also got chrome skull caps. And pressing the button on the door panel will fold the mirrors in. You've also got power windows and power door locks. And this vehicle is also equipped with two driver memory, eight way power driver and passenger seat with four way adjustable lumbar support. The premium perforated leather on the seats on the Limited are very nice and very supportive. You have stitched filigree accents, as well as diesel gray piping. Automatic headlamp control with fog lamps and cargo light. You've also got your interior illumination controls and instrument panel controls, electronic parking brake, and your power adjustable pedals with memory settings. Premium floor trim. All right, let's pan through the interior and show a little more detail. As you can see here, nice fluid electrically assisted power steering. The steering wheel is heated and features the pinstriped wood trim. You've also got the burnished copper accents, controls for the multi-view display controls, Uconnect controls, cruise control and adaptive cruise controls, as well as your gear change. Closer look at the ebony wood with the pinstriping on it. premium reconfigurable multi-view instrument cluster. Very easy to read gauges and you also have a new thin film transistor LCD screen in the center display which features various different readouts for uh, vehicle settings and trip information. This is a sped up view of all the details inside. Various screen setups. You do have four quadrants of smaller gauges in all four corners where you can change the displays and you've also got two bands on either side that can change various information readouts as well. It's a very comprehensive comprehensive system. All right, I'm panning over the top of the dash to see the stitched leather treatment. Dash top storage with a 12 volt power point. And this vehicle does have the all new 12 inch touchscreen display for the Uconnect system. And here's an overview of the touchscreen display. 
You have various controls at the bottom for heated and vanilla AC controls. Of course, you also have your dual zone climate control, navigation, AM, FM, Sirius XM satellite radio. And of course, the touchscreen does feature gestures for swipe and pinch to zoom. Nice large screen for your navigation with clear and easy to read graphics. And of course, you also have your phone pairing. Another nice feature of this screen is you're able to actually divide the top and the bottom with two different menus. And you can customize that pretty much any way you want to. And you can also switch, so if you want the navigation on top, you can move it to the top. And if you want it on the bottom, you can also move it to the bottom. Or you can close it out. Various settings for vehicle settings. All right, placing the vehicle in reverse does activate the park view backup camera. It does feature active guidance lines, as well as various different camera settings, and a 360 degree top down view. You got your trailer brake controls. Toggle switches for the air suspension. You've also got stability control, your tow haul mode, and the two buttons that turn on and off the power or the park view sensors. CD player, USB C ports, and USB 3 ports with an auxiliary input jack. Premium front center console, which features the ebony wood with the white pin striping. It also features the burnished copper accents. Cup holders and storage are inside. Sliding the tray backwards opens up a very deep storage area with the RAM charger wireless charging pad. Nice padded armrest with a limited tag framed with the stitched filigree. And inside is a felt lined storage area. And of course you have two levels of storage. Little engineering graphs on the molded on the inside of the lid. And down below you have nice deep storage. You've also got a timeline of the Ram trucks throughout history. And overhead you have a frameless automatic dimming rearview mirror. Three channel home link universal garage door opener controls are on the driver's side sun visor. A revised overhead console with the satin silver accents. LED overhead map lights as well as overhead area lighting. You've also got your Uconnect Assist and SOS. And of course you have your controls for your dual pane panorama sunroof. And naturally this vehicle is also equipped with the power opening or power sliding rear window. sunglasses holder, nice large sun visors with illuminated vanity mirrors, and of course the sun visors also slide on extension rails. All right, let's take a look at the rear seat. As one would expect, the level of attention to detail and craftsmanship is the same in the rear as it is in the front. The door treatment is the same with the accent stitching, the filigrees, the burnished copper, and the pinstripe wood accents all continue in the rear. And as you can see here, you do have the premium floor trim mats. Of course, we also still have the ram bins with removable liners, and they do have uh, metric and English measurements. Nice flat load floor, 
and the rear seat does seat three across. It is a 60-40 split folding seat with reclining seat backs, high adjustable head restraints, the stitched filigree accents and perforated leather seating surfaces. And in the center it folds down. It does feature a nice wide armrest with dual integrated cup holders and of course a storage tray. Overhead you do have LED lighting, more cup holders on the back of the front console, twin air vents, heated seat controls, there are three stage heated seats, and of course the USB-C and USB-3 ports continue, as well as a household style charging outlet. Seat back mat pockets for extra storage. And this is the control here for the seat recliner. It also lifts the seat up to reveal more storage underneath the seat bottom, as well as grocery bag hooks. This truck does feature a remote opening tailgate just by double pressing the button on the key fob or remotely open the tailgate. And this vehicle is equipped with a 5 foot 7 inch cargo box. The tailgate is dampened to assist in opening and closing. Cargo box dimensions are length at the floor with the gate closed of 67.4 inches with a width of 66.4 inches. The wheelhouse distance is 51 inches with a depth of 21.4 inches. Your gate opening width is 60 inches with a total cargo box volume of 53.9 cubic feet.
And this does conclude our in-depth walk-around look at the brand new 2019 Ram 1500 Limited Crew Cab. We hope the review was informative, and as always, thanks for watching.